let's look at this question <coughs> of uh, on complex numbers. Uh, the question reads like this: z to the power of four is equal to 81 cis. This is an abbreviation for cos plus r sine theta. 2 pi by 3. Find all the solution. You have to solve this uh, equation, okay, a complex equation. So uh, we are going to use this Dimwav's rule or theorem. Uh, this is the new formula sheets. If n is an integer, then r cis theta to the power n is r to the power n cis n theta. This is a very powerful theorem uh, to solve uh, equation. Okay, equations of um, complex roots. Okay, so yeah, this is in uh, radians. So I would like to change first this into degrees and then I'll come back to write in. Mm, radian. So I can say z to the power of 4 is 81 cis. Now this is pi is 180, so you can say 2 times 180 over 3. Okay, so z to the power of 4 is 81 cis. This is 360. Uh, 360 or oh, this is 60. Uh, 360 divided by 3 which is 120 so this is nothing but 120 degrees now using Dimwav's rule I want to find uh, this is the fourth power so if I want to find z can I say z to the power of 4 raised to 1 fourth is equal to 81 cis 120 to the power 1 fourth. Now why did I do 1 fourth? Because I want z. So if I raise this by 1 fourth, or this is the fourth root, so I have to take the fourth root of both sides. So this is say z1. Using Dimwav's rule, so this will become 81 to the power 1 fourth, or the fourth root of 81. Cis 1 quarter times 120. I'm using this rule. So what you do is you raise the modulus by n and you multiply the argument with this is the modulus and this is the argument. So you're multiplying the argument with n. So you're multiplying 1 quarter times 120. So z1 and fourth root of 81 is 3. Okay. Or you should be knowing that. Okay, I can do this on the calculator. Uh, you can go menu run 81 raised to 0.25. Or that is same as fourth root of 81, which is 3. So this is 3 cis how many degrees? 30 degrees. Now in complex roots or whenever if this is the fourth root, sorry, if this is a fourth uh, power equation, there should be four roots. And uh, the complex roots have a geometry. So what does it mean? Now what does this mean? What does this root mean? Let me explain this in a diagrammatic way. Suppose this is your y-axis and this is your x-axis. So let me draw a circle to explain graphically. So this is this is your y this is your y axis and this is your x axis so this is your x axis or this is your x and y axis okay or you can say this is your real arm we as we're talking about uh, this is your real arm and this is your imaginary arm so 3 cis 120 means you are this is a radius of 3 and you have to go uh, a, a radius of 30 degrees so this is a 30 degrees I'll try to do as best as possible so this is 3 this is a distance of 3 
and this is 30 degrees this is 30 degrees so this point is can be said as 3 cis 30 degree now the other roots uh, is within 360 so there are four roots within 360 so what you do is 360 divided by 4 which is 90 so the next root will be 90 away from here so z2 would be 3 cis if you add 90 this is 120 degree so the next root what uh, this is 90 and this is so this point or this is the next root which is so this is your z1 this is your z1 your z2 is 3 cis 120 degree so this is 3 cis 120 degree okay the next root is again 90 away from here so this is 3 cis if you add 90 this is 210 degree the 210 degree would come this is 180 and 30 away okay so this is your z this is your z2 sorry this is your z3 which is 3 cis let me write it properly 3 cis 210 degree z3 is equal to 3 cis 210 degree so this is this much this is 210 degrees and finally z4 is 90 away that is 3 cis if you add 90 that is 300 degrees we'll change this into radians later on so 300 this is 270 so oops i wanted to use so 200 and 300 degrees 270 and so this is z4 z4 is 3 cis 300 degrees so the roots have a geometry that is it is it is in a particular angle so this this angle is 300 degrees so you got four roots so these are the four roots and if you want to change this into radians it's pretty easy z1 is 3 cis 30 pi over 180 which is 3 cis uh, this is pi by 6 hmm? pi by 6 z2 is 3 cis z2 was 200 120 degrees so it's 120 pi over 180 which is 3 cis so this and this goes so this is 6 so 2 pi by 3 z3 is 3 cis 210 pi over 180 so i will use the calculator you go to 1 0 abc 180 which is 7 pi by 6 so this is 3 cis 7 pi by 6 and z4 is 3 cis 300 pi 300 pi over 180 which is 300 abc 180 is 5 pi by 3 which is 3 cis 5 pi by 3 so these are the four roots in in pi or in radians see you in the next video